Good afternoon, Neil. This is Scott Walker. Um, we met through Tracy, and I just wanted to shoot this video kind of showing how a um, online presence can benefit you and your company. And there's a few things that I wanted to go over. The first one being that, um, you know, if it's, you know, I know you're probably a lot of referral base right now, but if someone were to search a company online and they're not able to find them, that's the first thing that I always do is if I've never heard of them before. And so if I can't find them on the internet with just like their name, then I usually don't, you know, follow along and, and follow through with that. So that's the first thing that I re would recommend, but then I'm going to show you a few things that you can do either yourself or if you don't have the time to do that, that's where I'd be more than happy to help you out. Um, but for example, I'm going to just kind of use, you know, cause, uh, I know you're near me and Layton. I think you're in Kaysville. So I just did Plumber Kaysville, Utah. It looks like night and plumbing is one of your top competitors for that particular keyword. And what Google looks for on a homepage is a thousand to 2000 words of content on your homepage. And you also want to be found for buyer intent keywords. Um, and those would be like plumbing plus a location. So, um, you know, plumbing, Kaysville, plumbing, Layton, uh, water installation, water heater installation, uh, Ogden, Utah. I don't know the exact service areas that you have, but um, those are the types of keywords that you want to be found for. And then you want to have the content to back it up so that it's not just like, a, hey, we work here and that's it. Um but yeah, the other thing you could do is any photos or images, if you save them correctly, um, it says woman.jpg for that. So instead of woman.jpg, that could say plumber Kaysville, Utah, and that could count as a keyword because it's embedded behind the photo. So just kind of searching for, you know, a plumber in Kaysville, Utah, you get your Google guarantees and your local ads. These are great ways to generate business quickly if that's something you're looking for um because it's at the top of the page then you move into the google business profile which is uh your google map pack what google my business whatever you want to call it they're all the same thing um but a lot of people stop right here and a lot of people don't have ads showing up here so that's usually the first one for some people as well um you're not in the google business profile but there are lots of ways you can do it first you could get the google business profile then you could uh start having people leave your reviews um that shows google that you're growing your business organically you want to make sure that your name address and phone number the are, are the exact same all across the internet so google isn't misled and they think you're the uh let's see west end plumbing you know you don't want to be mountain west plumbing incorporated or west end plumbing in florida um the last thing you could do is add branded geotagged or geolocated photos weekly to show google that you're growing your business um, and those are all things that I can help you with and show you if you need, or um, I can do those for you as well. But being in the Google business profile in the top three gives you about 30 to 40% of the online traffic that are searching for this keyword um, each and every month. So, I mean, that's a lot of people that are stopping right here. And then we go into your, you know, a type of website um, where you would be ranking your website as opposed to um, your Google business profile or ads. And I, I'll do a quick uh, breakdown of Night and Plumbing for you. Um, this is just a tool I use called uh, Arifs. It just shows me analytics and kind of shows me where um, different websites are setting. The DR and UR is the strength and trust that Google has for a website. These are on a scale of 100 and you want these continuously moving up and also balanced. Um, you know, Knighton is currently at 0.6 and 8 and that's due to their backlink and referring domains uh, profile. And if you don't know what a backlink is, it's when one website links to another website via clickable button or text. Um, but not all backlinks are created equal. You do want to stay relevant to your industry and also your location whenever possible, uh, just so that uh, it stays relevant to what you're talking about on there. And then you want to uh, be indexed for keywords and the different keywords that Knighton is being found for. Obviously their name, there's 100 searches for it. They're in the number one position and they're getting about 40 traffic. 40 people to their website just off of their name. But these are the ones that I'm more interested in because these are the organic uh, growth of your company. Kaysville, Utah Plumbing, Plumbing, Utah, Kaysville, Utah, Plumbers, Kaysville, Utah. You know, just between those, there's 140 searches and these are on average each and every month. 
So they're getting 14, 17, 17, you know, because they're in the first position for all of those keywords. And these are the ones that I'm more interested in ranking. I mean, you can do Utah plumbers, but if you don't do the whole thing in Utah, it's not really that great. Um, KR plumbing Utah, I don't know exactly what that is. SLC plumber, I'm trying to find if there's a weird one. I guess there's not. Um, but sometimes, you know, you'll just be found for a spatula wall, something or other. And it's like, well, that doesn't really do anything for you. So I'm more interested in the buyer intent keywords. I know those are the ones that I want to rank you for. And then just to give you an example, um, I just looked at plumber in Kaysville and all variations of plumber. Um, so plumbing, plumber, plumbers, you know, all of that. There's over, you know, there's 370 searches each and every month just in Kaysville, Utah. And that's just specific to plumbing. That doesn't even include any specialized jobs you might want to be found for. But when you have, uh, when you're outranking your competitors and having better content, uh, those authoritative backlinks and the citations, a percentage of these searches will start going to your website instead of your competitors. And then, you know, the people going to your website, as long as it's relevant to their search, will start to either call or form submit. And then depending on your closing rate, will turn into a customer for you. So I really hope that this was beneficial for you, Neil, and I look forward to talking to you soon. Have a great day. Bye.